Uh, let me zoom in a little bit. You're a bit far away there. Oh, that's gone the wrong way. There we go. Right, that's a bit better. See more of my ugly, my ugly mug now. Cardinal Fang, <laughs> fetch the comfy chair. Yes, that's right. Pull up your comfy chair, grab a coffee, sit down, and watch. During the meanwhile, no, no, no. no. Hello, it's Dexter and me, the uh, the terrible, terrible terrier of you two. Uh, I've been getting fed up with my landscape photography lately. Um, it's not landscape photography's fault. It's just it's the time of year. Um, most people get uh, is it that sad seasonal affective disorder syndrome when the clocks go back in October. I get it when they go forward. Um, uh, since be since getting ill, I I struggle at the extremes of the day. So early morning, late nights, not good for me. So uh, anyway, uh, what I tend to do uh, when I get this sort of photographic malaise is tell myself not to take everything so seriously. You know, autumn is going to roll around again, and uh, you know uh, you can you can. Uh, get back out then uh, for you know your sunrises and your sunsets uh, but in the meantime you know just enjoy enjoy photography for what it is so uh, I listened to myself for once and uh, uh, I went out the other day with my XE1 and I'm not going to show you the front of it because it's got a surprise lens on it which you may not have seen yet you may have I'm not sure but you may not have um, which I tend, tend to take with me most places I go. It's, it's such a lovely lightweight uh, camera kit to do that. And uh, I took Dexter on the block um, and I thought I'm always looking down at my feet because one, uh, people uh, don't tend to uh, pick their dog's mess up sometimes, which is an awful, awful thing. You know, just pick it up. And two, uh, I got to be careful with my my footing and my balance and everything because if I fall, it could be quite and uh, break something. It can be quite quite disastrous. So uh, I have to watch where I'm going quite carefully. So I found myself, you know, you're looking down at the pavement, and it's a whole new world down there of like you know little bits of um, plants and well, mostly weeds, you know, growing out of cracks in the pavement. And I figured that that could make for. Uh, a really nice uh, little photographic uh, project for you know uh, a couple of days so over the last two days when I've um, uh, walked it, Dexter the, the short distance that I can walk in um, I've been doing just that you know looking down at my feet and uh, snapping away at the world below me and I got some all oh, right they're not award-winning images they're never going to go in on a website or in a book but uh, I figured they were worthy of, you know, putting out in a little, a little video. Uh, I shot, I think it was twelve or thirteen in all, um, of you know things growing out of. I should have a look at them actually. Things growing out of the, um, out of the cracks in the pavement. Uh, uh, one thing I've become obsessed with recently is dandelions. No, <laughs> they are the scourge of the gardener. You dandelion because they grow everywhere. Um, and people hate them, but I think they are such a beautiful plant. Um, and one of the images I've got here, if I can find it, uh, it's got all four stages of the dandelion. You've got like a little bud, you've got a flower, then you've got the lovely sort of, you know, seed head, full seed head, and then it's like a half empty seed head. Um, and I've become rather obsessed with dandelions lately because I've been what, looking around, uh, trying to find ones with, you know, like one... Um, one little seed head left on it, one or two, and, uh, and photographing those. Um, so uh, yeah, I might pop one of those up now. They, they don't form part of this project, uh, but I'll pop one of those images up now that I shot uh, shot quite recently. Uh, yeah. So um, uh, another one of the images is uh, like an abstract of some. I think it's like cherry blossom or something fall on the um, onto the, like the lawn and then onto the pavement. Uh, so I shot that completely out of focus uh, as quite an abstract image yeah, and it kind of works it, it's quite a nice image to look at and there are some really quite pretty flowers just growing out of cracks in the pavement and cracks in you know people's front walls you know in the brickwork uh, so yeah uh, I had a really enjoyable um, couple of hours 
out with Dexter. I don't walk fast anyway, so a couple of hours soon is like around the block. But uh, it was quite a, a quite an enjoyable little walk with him, and uh, you know he he helps me you know to to root out things. He's always you know um, looking about on rooting around in the, in the foliage there. Uh, yeah, so I'm really really quite pleased with uh, with some of the images I've got. Anyway, uh, that is it for this very very short little video. So. Uh, I will pop up the uh, images that I took now. Uh, I think there's uh, 13, I think, something like that, maybe 13. Uh, I'll pop them up now and uh, yeah, uh, just enjoy. And, um, you know, what do you do when you get into, a, you know, a, a slump uh, or you lose your muse, you know, your your photographic, you know, juices desert you? What do, what do you tend to do? Do you just have a complete break or do you try and do something different, uh, you know, or do you uh, just, you know, Try and plow on through it. <laughs> um, all of them, uh, all of them can work really. But uh, what I tend to do, as I say, is just take a step back uh, and try and do something a bit, a little bit, a little bit off the wall and a little bit different. Yeah. So uh, that's it. Uh, as usual, thanks ever so much for watching. Stay safe. Stay well. Uh, look after yourselves, your loved ones, your pets, and and be nice. Just be nice. And uh, yeah, get out and do this, you know, before the council starts spraying weed killer. <laughs> Which they have a tendency to do at this time of year. So uh, yeah, get out and about and take, uh, take some pictures. See you all very soon. Bye-bye. Joe.